So I just want to apologize in advance if you hear something in the background that is my washing machine going and maybe one of the dogs might make some noise. But I am currently about to meal prep and I am about to go in with my Goya black bean soup. And this one is prepared with olive oil, bell peppers and onions. And I really, really love this one because it's very flavorful and I do not have to add anything into it at all so next up i am going to go in with my corn and and so i'm going to just add this tablespoon of butter and when i go in with my seasoning i do not use any salt but i just went in with some black pepper i'm going to use some onion powder And I'm going to go in with some garlic powder.
and I know it looks like I might be putting in a lot, but I mean, you have to mix it up first. Um, what else am I going to use? I'm going to use some garlic and herb seasoning, and then that's going to be it for the corn. Oh, I'm going to add one more thing. Actually, I'm not going to add another thing. So that's all I'm going to add to my corn. I'm not going to stir it up. I'm going to allow it to um, cook first and then I'll mix it up after. And then I am going to go ahead and heat up my pan because I am going to be putting some ground turkey in here. So basically what I'm cooking or what I'm making is my meal prep for today, which is Monday through Thursday. And it's going to be like a, it's a healthy Chipotle bowl, if you think about it. So um, I'm not gonna have everything that I normally would get from Chipotle. I could, but I just feel like this is very simple and easy. So I'm going to do some ground turkey. I'm going to season it, but I'm not gonna use any salt. Um, I got my corn that you just saw me season and then I have my black beans over there that I did not season because I'm telling you guys if you get that specific brand you do not have to add anything to it. So I just let that heat up and then I'm also going to make some couscous and then that's going to be my assembly for my entire meal. So you're going to have your ground turkey, your corn, your black beans, and your couscous. And then that's pretty much what my meal is going to be for the next four days as far as like my lunch goes. So for breakfast, I alternate between a pack of oatmeal or a um, breakfast sandwich, which I can show you guys really quick what I use for that. And then I'll kind of explain to y'all like the purpose of all this in a second. So everything is done and complete. And then I'm just going to take this one fourth uh, cup of everything as far as like the corn, the couscous and the black beans. I'm just gonna evenly distribute the meat in all four of the containers just because who really gonna eat? <laughs> That's a little bit amount of meat, but Normally, I go and do one fourth in every um, container, and then if I have a little bit more left over, if I feel like I need two of these, then I'll just go in with two. But yeah, so I'm just about to evenly distribute everything in each container, and then y'all can just watch me do it.
So now I am back from the gym. I am about to heat up my meal prep. So also for a snack as well, I might eat one of these peanut butter dark chocolate con bar. This is 200 calories. I really don't care about calories, but if that helps anybody, but yeah. So it's uh, the peanut butter and dark chocolate. I absolutely hate dark chocolate, but with these con bars, most of them are dark chocolate, but you really cannot like taste it because you have so much going on like on the bar. So you have like peanuts, you have some oats, almonds, peanut butter like so it's just a lot going on you really can't taste the dark chocolate but if i don't eat one of those i might eat one of my muffin cups and again for those that care this is 260 calories and that's a lot um but i think that's a lot <laughs> I guess it just depends on how many calories you consume throughout the day and how many calories you have set for yourself that you want to like have per day. I don't necessarily have an amount of calories I want to have per day, but I do believe there is a such thing as too many calories. So whatever that looks like for you, just wanted to let you guys know that. So I'll be having one of these as a snack after I eat my lunch and then I don't have anything else planned for the rest of the day. So I'll pick up with y'all later and yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay, hopefully this is great lighting. I just got back from the grocery store. The angle might be weird, but I gotta get these groceries put up. So I just figured I'll show you guys what I got from the grocery store really quick while I put it up. So I figure I start with the cold items. And this grocery trip was literally vibes. So we have some chicken tenderloins. I like to get these because I make tacos with those. I got some boneless chicken thighs. I got some ground turkey and then I got some brown sugar glazed salmon which I'm about to cook right now because this is going to be my lunch today and the next two days after that so let me go ahead and preheat the oven while I'm thinking about it so next up we have some eggs I used to get the big um Heck, but I have been alternating between my breakfast lately, so I don't need the whole like 24 pack or whatever. Go ahead and hurry up and put this in the refrigerator. I also got some birthday cake cookies, the best ones. Also got me some Kung Fu tea. It's the Taro Slush. Okay, so next up we have some onions, some bell peppers, we have some broccoli, which I am going to be fixing with my salmon. And then we have some lettuce, which is for the tacos. So I got some more creamer, the Planet Oat Milk Creamer. I prefer the caramel one over the vanilla one. I don't like the vanilla one at all. So I got the, I got some biscuits. And then I got some Simply Lemonade. I usually don't buy juices like this, but we tried that TikTok trend and you're supposed to use like the zero sugar lemonade. Um, I don't think, I don't know if it's Simply Lemonade or not, but I had grabbed two packs of Kool-Aid and we have one more left. So we actually liked it, but I think I wanna try it this time with just some regular lemonade and see if it tastes good. So. I'm probably gonna pour some of that in here, put that in the refrigerator, and then once we finish that, I probably won't buy Kool-Aid again for a while because I don't buy Kool-Aid. It's been years since I bought Kool-Aid. So this is the first time I purchased Kool-Aid probably in like over six, seven years now. So yeah. So I also picked up some of this Freshetta pizza normally i just get the regular pepperoni and i normally get the thin crust but my husband was like can we just get the thick crust because i guess as we've been working out like our 
metabolism and our hungerness like we be wanting more and more food so i just started back getting the thicker ones and then i also picked this one up i never seen this one before this is the supreme one so it has sausage pepperoni green and red and yellow peppers and onions all the things that i love so it's probably gonna be good so sorry if you hear noise in the background it's jackson So I also picked up another kombucha in the pomegranate flavor. I have two other flavors in the refrigerator already, so I just grabbed this one. So I picked up some couscous. I picked up two of the peach vibes, two of the Fuji apple pear, two of the Alani New Hawaiian shaved ice energy drinks. I also got a six pack of the bold ginger ale, six pack of the cheer wine. That's for me, that's for my husband. I don't drink cheer wine. Um, also picked up some grape jelly, some apple jelly, some cran raspberry, cran apple. I like getting these little chicken broths because sometimes I will open one and then I don't use it for a long time and then it like goes bad. So I like using these because usually I need the whole one little bottle. I think one bottle is a cup of the chicken broth. I also got some Pam for laziness purposes. I got two boxes of the Homestyle Rice Krispie Treats. One because they always going out of stock and I love Rice Krispie Treats and I love these. Like they taste way better than the other ones. I don't know what they did different, but I will keep buying this one. I also got some banana muffins i got some bagel thins for my breakfast i got a box of the street tacos which i will be having for tacos tonight i also picked up a pack of spaghetti uh noodles and then i needed some aluminum foil and then i also picked up a bottle of syrup i also picked up a bottle of the cupcake Moscato wine if it will focus so I picked up picked up some of this cupcake Moscato wine picked up a pack of paper towels I got some trash bags I also got some cleaning spray for the kitchen and then I got a pack of water. So that's everything I got from the grocery store.